This is Chris Pickering of uh, Racetech TV, and I'm joined by Alex Hitzinger of Porsche Motorsport. Um, so, um, Alex, the, the obvious question is how are things uh, progressing on the uh, LMP project? Yeah, we are obviously very busy. We're testing for more than half a year now. Uh, so, we have learned a lot about the car, improved uh, a lot uh, in terms of uh, performance, uh, reliability. We still have a long way to go, for sure, because it's a complete new car, very complex car. Uh, but it's looking okay, looking good. Okay. What do you think has been the hardest part of the, the project so far from an engineering perspective? Um, it's difficult to say what is the hardest part. The whole thing is uh, extremely challenging for sure because uh, we have a lot of development freedom. Um, we have uh, very uh, complex technologies which we, are, uh, which we have to develop uh, uh, and partially completely from scratch, so there is absolutely nothing to base on. Uh, we started with a complete clean piece of paper. We had didn't have any base car to base anything on, no references, nothing. Um, we had to build the, the whole team from scratch. We, we started with like 10 people, and now we are more than 200 mm -hmm. within two years. Uh, we even built infrastructure, uh, developed IT tools, processes. So we really started like a, a green field. That's in a that's all in a very short period of time, uh, with a very challenging technology uh, and very very tough competition. So yeah, it's all been very difficult, but uh, it's all, all looking good and uh, it's very enjoyable. I guess in some respects starting from a, a clean sheet of paper is also a positive thing. You have no sort of preconceptions and you can go straight into a, a new era for, for sports car racing with a, a fresh perspective on the, uh, on the challenge. I guess uh, there is always a positive side. Yeah, you can find a positive side to anything. But uh, it certainly doesn't, uh, in this case, doesn't make it uh, easier to, to start with everything from scratch. It would have been nice for sure if you would have a complete established team, infrastructure, processes, everything, and you start then with a new design. But if you have to do that on top of everything else, it doesn't make it easier. But uh, for sure, it's from a, from a technical point of view, from an engineering point of view, it's uh, good fun, mm. for sure. So obviously this, this project um, was created with uh, you know, 2014 onwards in mind. At what point does it become sort of mature? You know, do you, are you looking for results in 2014, or are you looking for the project to sort of really come to fruition in 2015 and beyond? Oh, it's very difficult to say. I don't think anybody knows right now where they stand. So I think we just have to uh, be surprised where we will be. That sounds good. Oh, right, Alex, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs>